Hello guys, Sujari speaking. Welcome to Bedtime Stories, episode number um four and forty-two. Today we do um the final part of Mickey Mouse a Little Golden Book Collection. So let's read it down, shall we? So we got for us. Now the final part we're gonna read you is Steamboat Willie. Now it's a Mickey Mouse short from 1928 of November. And it is adopted by Melissa Lagarno, published by Golden Book New York release. Here we go. See here is Mickey Mouse going. <laughs> yeah, something like that. But I don't know the, the whistle. Sorry, much more up. Anyway, the reason why I deleted the uh, lunchtime episode for some reason because um difficulties. Anyway, on November eighteenth, nineteen twenty-eight. The Walt Disney Company made history by releasing Steamboat Willie, first MH film with super like sound, okay? Um, little cartoon mouse with a big personality was given a voice. Based on the creative version of the man named Walt Disney, okay? The breakthrough in the animation was na made Mickey Mouse a star, okay? Once there's a, a deckhand named Mickey who loves the whistle of Jolly, too. As he would stir a, the boat down the river, rolling river, something like that. Anyway, now, I did this as two several times. One is the Boring Jokester episode, and another one is Elgin Rips. Check it out in both of those accounts. YouTube, and of course, Rumble. Link in the description below, ladies and gentlemen. So anyway, next page. Anyway. But stirring the boat was Captain Pete's job. Wow. Stealing, eh? As I talk about during these two shows. Respectively. Anyway. If you have ever plans for Mickey. You have to deck hand to get back to making him this is there. You kidding me? Anyway. Pete took the wheel and turned back the, his back on Mickey. Yeez. Yeah, um. But Mickey did not like being bossed around by Captain P. Yeez. Thank God for that. Anyway, he stuck his tongue around the Captain Pete's back. Psst. Okay, I don't know how to do that. Sorry. Psst. Anyway, Mickey soon to learn that Pete was not a cat. Not was not a captain to fool with him. You know what, Mickey? For some reason, tell him uh, to get away from, from his wheel, something like that. Um, Cap Mickey walked down to the with that at the bottom of the stairs. He stepped. Spevin a wet sponge. Okay, come on, SpongeBob SquarePants difference. Be careful, SpongeBob. Anyway, zoo. He fell in the bucket and went for a war. Wow. Splash. Ha 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 ha. The parrot said, Oh my god. See this parrot? Shut up. Please. Thank you. Passy parrot aboard the ship. Laugh at him, poor Mickey. Wow. You know, this parrot is not nothing but n bull, bull crap. Anyway, I don't know what to say in this, in, in two different shows I made up, but this is a ridiculous idea I've ever seen. This whole parrot. Anyway, next page. Anyway, meanwhile, it was a business as usual at Poe Dog's uh, Landing. The see what's next stop. Wow, okay. Moo. You know, it's a huge skinny st cow, okay? In the. In the Animation stall, okay? Boat tickets, okay? Cows, roosters, goats, and other animals wait patiently to be loaded on the steamboat, okay? Animation style difference, anyway. Chugga, 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 woohoo! Wow, okay. Steamboat honk, now there's arrival. Mickey rushed aboard, preparing the dock with two. The boat was low of animals. It took uh, some quick. It took some squid figures, that, but Mickey got all the animals for plenty of time. With the exception of the cow, because it got the head in the uh, part of the cow, which is a great idea to make more sense now. It, it was a great idea, so there you go or not. Next page. Anyway, I've always had to make more sense in my ribs episode, have a, a bad episode, which is make ba bad ideas. But that makes more sense to edit out parts of it, you know? Steve started to leave the dock when Mickey looked back at the start. Oh crap. Um, someone comes running to chat the boat. Yoo hoo, yoo hoo. 
Pass the call out, trying to get some the ball grabs his attention. Her name is Minnie. But Cap Pete was never waited for passengers. Something like that. He turned the sea boat for and pull away from the dock. Mickey was determined to help the pastor. Wow. This pastor was Pete was Minnie Mouse. And already in cell to make more sense. And it has to be Minnie Mouse all along. So to make more sense, at least do something about this. Next page. Anyway, using a big hook. Oh, wow. Wow, look at me's butt. <laughs> um, Mickey scooped me up and left her uh, on the water. It's my dad. Mm-hmm. Then he saw me forward her down on the boat. Mickey took a good look at the new passenger. He thought she was so very pretty. We wanted to press her. Wow. It was like an animation style for the Disney difference, you know? Make more of these new more of my little, little golden book, please. Thank you. At least do something about these golden bo um, public domain books, please. Thank you. Anyway. Next page. Anyway, come on. We need. We're almost done with this book, man. Anyway. Anyway. Mickey noticed that Mickey uh, B had a guitar, so he had to decide to play her a song. But no, Mickey had to have any instruments, okay? So he had to get, get, get Gary, grieve. Rat tap, tap, to my dot. Mickey drum a trash can. Clink, clink, clink. He bang on the barrel. Wow. Rick crank. Mickey strong in the you know, boat's washboard, my dot. Bang, bang, bong. He hit some pots and pans. That's a great idea. You know, makes a difference, whole instruments difference. So there you go. Good idea, Mickey. I even though it's a great idea, make more difference in any way. So there you go. Next page. Mickey made music all over the boat. Mickey and the instrument animal passengers were impressed by his performance. Good idea. In the end of the song. He took a bow, but suddenly, grrr. You kidding me, Captain Pete? You have to do this to make fun of us? They stood Captain Pete, and he didn't look happy. Mickey was so close to work, be working. And I felt worried for Mickey. I don't want Pete to be disturbed, you know, to make more sense, you know? Okay. Two, three more pages left. Anyway. People let Mickey back to the deck. He yelled at Mickey to get back and then making his dinner. Ha 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 ha. Well, this yeah, this made no sense. Mickey was peed off at the at the parrot and and just splash over the parrot and say ha 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 ha. Well, that was the last three pages. Okay, four or five pages anyway. I was close anyway. Last three pages now anyway. Um, the page page was back. He was laughing, laughing at uh, Mickey again. Ha, 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 ha. Shut up. Anyway, splash. So the parrot fell up the window and Mickey had the last laugh. Wow. I have to agree with this. This is a great idea. Last page of this huge book says this. Mickey's Child Cartoon. The end. Walt Disney comic. And that was in, that was in 1928. Seen here. There you go on that. So that was basically um, Mickey Mouse logo book co co collection. What did I think about this book? It was amazing. So far this book was a success. Huge book. It might have been seven books past. And it was a fish touch to celebrate Mickey Mouse being the public domain. And that was Bedtime Stories, episode number 4 and 42. Hope you enjoy it. Stay tuned, that's going to be Bedtime Stories, episode 4 and 43, which will be about Jungle Cruise. Till next time, to Jerry's Box, baby, your boy Bedtime Stories, episode 42. Stay out. See ya.